PDCA cycle is an iterative process for continually improving products, people and services. It became an integral part of what is known today as lean management. The plan to check act model includes solution testing, analyzing results and improving the process. For example, imagine that you have plenty of customer complaints about the slow response rate of your support team. Then you will probably need to improve the way your team works to keep customers satisfied. That is the point where PDCA comes into play. Let's take a closer look at the four stages of the PDCA process. Number one, plan. At this stage, you will literally plan what needs to be done. Depending on the project size, planning can take a major part of your team's efforts. It will usually consist of smaller steps so that you can build a proper plan with fewer possibilities of failure. Keep in mind, you and your team may need to go through the plan a couple of times before being able to proceed. In this case, it is appropriate to use a technique for creating and maintaining open feedback loops. Such as Hoshin Kanvi catch wall, it will allow you to collect enough information before you decide to proceed. Number 2. Do After you have agreed on the plan, it is time to take action. At this stage, you will apply everything that has been considered during the previous stage. Be aware that unpredicted problems may occur at this phase. This is why in a perfect situation, you may first try to incorporate your plan on a small scale and in a controlled environment. Standardization is something that will definitely help your team apply the plan smoothly. Make sure that everybody knows their role and responsibility. Number 3. Checked This is probably the most important stage of the PDCA cycle. If you want to clarify your plan, avoid recurring mistakes and apply continuous improvement successfully, you need to pay enough attention to the check phase. This is the time to audit your plans, execution and see if your initial plan actually worked. Moreover, your team will be able to identify problematic parts of the current process and eliminate them in the future. If something goes wrong during the process, you need to analyze it and find the root cause of the problem. Number 4. Act Finally, you arrive at the last stage of the plan to check act cycle. Previously, you develop, applied and checked your plan. Now you need to act. If everything seems perfect and your team managed to achieve the original goals, then you can proceed and apply your initial plan. It can appropriate to adopt the whole plan if objectives are met. Respectively, your PDCA model will become the new standard baseline. However, every time you repeat a standardized plan, remind your team to go through all steps again and try to improve carefully. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, subscribe to our channel.